Welcome back. Well, we know one of us is looking forward to the weekend. You it's actually Friday. Next Level Wednesday, <laughs> not right. Friday. And today's today, WBKB <laughs> Stephanie Minichi heads over to Alpena High School to talk about teaching. Tate Skiba, thank you for joining me today. So you're a social studies teacher and you've been teaching for about three years at Alpena High School. But when you were a kid, what did you want to be? I, I always thought as a kid I would end up as a, a lawyer, maybe some big corporate lawyer in uh, New York or Boston. Uh, I thought that was kind of my destiny. So tell me about the shift from Boston, New York, and then you're back in Alpena. I went to, to U of M right out of high school and uh, it, it was fun, it was nice to get a taste of what life was like somewhere else, uh, but I figured out fairly quickly that uh, my life here really was pretty good. Uh, I enjoyed the small town a lot more than I enjoyed the city. Um, so I, I graduated from college and actually I graduated a semester early. So I came back to Alpena uh, in between when I graduated and when I wanted to go to law school. and. Uh, somebody told me, why don't you try substitute teaching to make a little extra money in the few months that you're here? And I said, well, okay, I will. And so I, I was a substitute teacher for a few months uh, on my, my off semester. And after a few months of, of subbing, I said, no, we've got to go back to school. This is what it's got to be. So was there a magical moment where you said, this is it? I can't point to one particular moment where a switch flipped uh, I just I think I was enjoying myself every day going and being with the kids and I was envisioning you know I was, I was doing other people's lessons and implementing other people's lessons and I thought wouldn't it be fun if I could do my lessons I mean with COVID going on and and just being a teacher in general what's the most important thing you feel students need students need to know that they're in a, a safe place to learn that regardless of uh, you know what's going on at home that things are going to be fine when they're at school can you name your most challenging time with a student uh, I can remember a particular student that I had in my first year. Our personalities didn't get along very well. This student was uh, very headstrong, um, did not care for my class, did not mind saying that she didn't care for my class. I really feel like I went into that situation with one foot in a bucket. She stormed out of my room twice, uh, but after a couple of months of um, just trying to make it work. Uh, we ended up with a decent relationship. Uh, and uh, by the end of the year, we actually, she, she got asked to sing the national anthem at a festival in the little town where I was teaching. And she came into my room one day and said, Mr. Stig Mr. Skiba, would you come and sing this with me? That is such a touching outcome, and I'm sure gratifying for you. Tate Skiba, thank you so much for joining me today. And you can tune in next week for Next Level Wednesday, where your next level may be explored. In Alpena, Stephanie Minichi, WBKB News.